Embraer X is using a flight simulator to do early development work for its planned new Evitol aircraft. The Brazilian company has already flown scale models of the new design and has conducted some wind tunnel testing for what is a four-seat all-electric model. According to the Embraer X team, the engineering development simulator trials are using real flight control parameters and control laws to gather accurate data that can be used in the type certification process. Test pilots have also been evaluating the fly-by-wire controls that are based on the technology Embraer has already developed for its business aircraft and commercial airliners. This is a tool that has been found to be very useful and very powerful in previous aircraft development at Embraer. In it, we fly the very same control laws that will be flown in our eVTOL vehicle. We also develop the human-machine interface that will be available on the vehicle before it goes autonomous. I had the privilege to, be, uh, to perform the first flight of the uh, aircraft, mainly uh, I had two uh, inceptors uh, to control the aircraft. It was as simple as that, as friendly as that, and the flight was absolutely easy to perform. So far, Embraer has been very secretive about its EVATOL project and has not published any timeline for when it might be aiming to get the aircraft into service. Early drawings show an aircraft with eight propellers fitted on four beams attached to two narrow parallel wings protruding from the top of the fuselage to provide vertical lift. At the rear of the aircraft, there seem to be a pair of ducted fans for cruise flight. On July 27, 2020, the company filed a trademark application for a product called EVE by Embraer X. The application described this as an electric vertical takeoff and landing vehicle that can transport people. Thanks for watching this AIN video. Please like, subscribe, and share it if you've enjoyed it. Also, visit AINonline.com for all the latest on the aviation industry.